Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the most beautiful thing that's happened in my recent history. This is Nathan out of Semi-Casual Gaming, and I have a Beast Snagas box. Yes, I made bets at work, I took care of other things, I, took, I wheeled and dealed with the most important person in my wife, my wife, my wife, in my life, who is my wife. Either way, I have one. So we're going to do a quick unboxing video on camera here. I've got Mr. Glenn on, on cameras today to show you guys. So um, first off, as you guys know, this is 40K. This is everything I'm expecting to see in it. I have heard reports of some mispacked boxes, but that's always going to happen with these mass production things. So it's Love like Glenn, use those muscles. It's like Christmas all Come over on, again. Nate. Don't worry, I got commentary on this. <laughs> we got Bryce in the background on commentary. Oh. Not really. It's me just making fun of you. <laughs> that's that's perfectly fair. That's perfectly fair. So we have the box. Dun, 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 now, it looks dun, like how it opens. I think you just slide, slide it. Slide so, um, Interesting. So you know, we'll do it this way. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Bryce, on the audible. We're gonna go like that so people can look at that. That's beautiful. That is so beautiful. I want this box. This is a pretty box. Yeah, the art for it's phenomenal. Like, honestly. And now I want to get one of these boxes. And I don't even play Orcs in 40K. And of course, the classic Orc symbol. And then we got two slider boxes. So we're going to go ahead and try not to destroy the box. Dude, I would have destroyed it. Oh, I know. I know. I'm really bad about it. And here we go. Oh. So, nothing else in the box. All right. Obviously, we have all the sprues. We have the objective cards. We've got all the bases. We have all the fun stuff. I'll t I'm actually going to do, guys, for this video, the cards and the book, which is at the bottom here. I'm going to do a separate video at home with the unbooking. I'm just too excited to uh, pull out the pieces. So the first one, this is Squig Hog Boys. You can tell with uh, the big writers. It looks like it's, oh, this is, I'll say that in a second. So we got this the Squid Hog Boys here. There's probably another sprue because it looks like that's only a couple. This sprue right here is the Rod Grod Wurtz Nort Wurt Grod Rod. Bring, bring it down. A a dude that, okay. It, it's it's, it's a dude there. with a dude. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, okay. As we're testing at the camera. Um, the basically the crazy grot herder, which a lot of people are talking about running as just a weird boy or a wer boy, which I might very well do as well because what? it's got it, it's really funny. He's got a hair squig, though. Yes, he's got a super hair squig. He's got several of them. But the thing is, there are no grots in this box. Except yeah, except for the one riding on the squig hog. So it's like they put him in there, but he's not actually supporting. Um, this is the knob on the big squig that comes in the box, which I was really excited about. Oh, and you see over here, here's the third um, squig hog boy. So we've got squig hog, squig hog, squig hog, and then the big knob right here with the two separate arms. You can either do the big choppa or the pistol. I have not yet decided which one I want to do, but options. So the uh, next batch, and this is the rest of the box, 20 uh, Beast Snaga boys, which are supposed to be slightly bigger than the regular boys. I can tell right now that they are in fact a hair bigger than the regular guys. Not so much to be like, I think they're roughly like the older knobs, but the newer knobs are bigger than these guys. But um, yeah, we have a whole bunch of choppa bits um, over hiding around on these sprues somewhere. I'll see if I can find them. I don't see it on this one. There's, oh yeah, the big, big choppa. Uh, the thump guns that come with them. So, yes, that's what they're called, the thump guns. That's the, what looks like the, oh yeah, uh, no, the, uh, what you call it, the pistolier, the bandolier type thing. So, we have a whole bunch of stuff in here. And then the most exciting thing here as of all, we have our custom artwork, which that's exactly what I was gonna say. What's the most exciting thing of all? Um, yeah, just some cool custom artwork with. Uh, Are there two of them in there? Uh, mm -hmm. oh, did I actually get two? Mm -hmm. Well, hey, look at me. I got two. I got a lucky misprint. You want to take a look at that, good sir? So, um, and then the beauty. Of course, the we'll do. We'll save the best for last. This is the brand new transfer sheet they have. It has all the different clans and stuff on it. I don't personally use transfer sheets, so I may find somebody who does and is interested and do a trade or a sell or something. But look how pretty these are. They look. They just something about them. They just look new, like fresh. Like, wow, those are really good. Wow, those are, wow. Yeah, they're actually really good quality. They look like they're in really good shape. 
And, I mean, obviously they're brand new, but you've got your Death Skulls, your Blood Axes, Evil Suns, Bad Moons, oh, Goths up in the, on the top left there. I mean, every, all, the, all the boys are covered here. So, And now, for your final viewing pleasure, the limited edition 40K Codex with all the build instructions t taped to the back. That was exactly not what I was expecting there, but that would make sense. <laughs> so here's the, uh, the Codex here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and open it on this camera because we're going to look at it off camera and then later I'm going to do my, my personal review of the book and such. So here is where we do the horrible attempt on the corners. No, I hate it. Uh, you're going to open it to the center and smell it, right? Of course. you got to do the, the initial... Oh, I actually got the tear. Look at that beautiful tear. Look at that beautiful plastic. It's so satisfying. It's just such a great feeling, a great sensation right there. And then, yeah, build instructions over here and the uh, honorary. I'm going to put it up to the camera so you all get to enjoy Stratagem's Plage. Can you smell it? Can you guys smell all oh, that oh, fresh, smell from here. fresh Ooh. book smell? Oh, oh that smells good. Huh. So nice. Well, folks, I know this is a fun, silly little video. Uh, if you guys put a bid in to get one of these, I hope you did. I know a lot of people didn't. I know the scalpers really messed up this batch. But hopefully Games Workshop will be kind and do what they have been doing with the scalpers and then just releasing a new batch right afterwards. But with the limited edition codex, I don't see that being as likely. So um, I'm very grateful. I'm very appreciative of Black Dragon Games, the host of where we, when I'm playing in the stores, to uh, give me the opportunity to snag one of these boxes. <laughs> to beast snag one of these boxes. <laughs> so um, all right, guys. I hope you enjoy this. Please like, comment, subscribe. Shortly after this video gets posted, I'm going to post up the unbooking video of this as well. In the meantime, good fights, good night.